This is a demonstration of a slight twist on some of the popular pre-trained models. Like for example, I'm going to be demonstrating keyword extraction and summary extraction, which are very popular. In this case, I'm doing a little twist uh, specific to education. So you'll notice here that this demo file has lessons. It has a long form transcription of lessons, which could either be extracted from a Zoom session online, or the instructor could have just put their lesson plan into that field. Or maybe this is where they store that information. And here we have a pre-trained model that does a simple keyword extraction. In this case, uh, specific to the instructor, they would want to uh, pull lesson objectives. So here we can use the GPT-3 model to give us a return delimited list of lesson objectives from this transcription. That's pretty basic. Over here, I have a field that is gonna pull a lesson synopsis, which is a classic example of a summary extraction. But the twist that I've put on here is that I've used GPT-3 to tweak the summary that we get back so that we can get a summary at a very specific grade level. These grade levels are often referred to as lexile levels or reading levels. So here I could say I want to get a fifth grade uh, summary or a 12th grade summary. So let's say, for example, I want to pull over a grade seven version of a summary. And our summary is created specific to that reading level. You can see a slight difference here. If I go to grade 12, do the same thing. And so we can use GPT-3 to really fine tune the type of le learning level that we get from each one of these summary extractions. I thought that was a particularly interesting use case within education. Now we can use this exact same model in kind of a reverse fashion. So let's say for example here, students are assigned different lessons. If we look at this student, Boo Radley, they were assigned the lesson of writing an essay on the legislative branch. Now, Boo Radley is a student who is at grade level or instructional level seven. Now, what I'm gonna do is use the same model in reverse that I just showed you to extract the summary to tell me what the text grade level is. So the grade level of the essay. So for example, if I run the analysis, this tells me that this was at grade level nine. Now I highlighted that a little bit differently because perhaps maybe this individual has a range of an instructional level range between seven and nine, or perhaps maybe we're using this to identify that there is maybe some plagiarism or some parents, you know, maybe involved in, uh, in, in helping them write these essays. But the idea here is that this information that comes back could tell you what the instructional level should be, whether the student's essays are consistent, whether maybe they're plagiarizing or maybe someone else helped them. If you get something that comes in at a high school level, for example, it might tell you that they might have received some help. So um, a slight twist on keyword extraction and then actually using the same model to determine what the reading level is of text that was presented, in this case, in the form of an essay by a student.